Okay, welcome back to another episode of Dawn of Man. Now, I have had a little bit of a problem with this episode. Which means it's going to be a bit delayed. And the reason why it's a bit of a problem is because of a donkey. I have a donkey. I have several donkeys. The problem with the donkeys is that they, they don't have a very good pathing system. <laughs> so what happens is that in a bit, a couple minutes from now, uh, a blizzard will start. A very nasty blizzard and that blizzard will um, will cause a lot of problems for my people so I'm gonna cancel everything from a, a, a safe distance including all of these uh, wood chopping these trees and I'm gonna say do not repair that either yep, 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 yep. good I want everybody to stay as close to the um, to this as possible to here put those too high yes I know I need to cancel that. I need to cancel the fishing. I want to cancel all of it. <clears throat> that one as well. Bam. Now, I do know that my uh, villagers all need to uh, work on the fields. They need to plant everything. They need to plant this stuff. Right? All this has to be planted. The problem is... <laughs> uh, oh, we got, we got a death here? Oh, this is something else. Never mind. Never mind. This is, there's a, a Morgar. He died a little while ago. But anyways, the problem is that um, once I have the blizzard started, once the blizzard, blizzard starts, I will have several people out here um, that will want to try and get stuff. Like this... Uh, <clears throat> like the stone, for instance. Or sorry, the tin, this tin. They'll try and get the tin... Uh, with a donkey, and uh, this person here, for instance, this person is going to go get log. Go get log. Okay, the log somewhere around here. I don't know where, but the, as soon as that uh, person go gets the, gets the log, um, I then send this person in to <laughs> warm up or something. There's also another donkey somewhere around here. Can I see where it is? Uh, I don't see the donkey. Um, oh, there it is. There it is. There's that donkey. There's that donkey. Now, this donkey here, for instance, right? Last time it happened twice with this donkey. This donkey is going to try and come back here. The person is going to try and... Some person is going to... Well, one villager is going to go try and get this donkey. He's going to get into trouble. Going to get a huge uh, hypothermia. But he's still going to walk the donkey back. So I grab this person, because he's close to death. And I run him all the way back to the village. Problem is, the donkey can't run. <laughs> so the donkey gets stuck. <clears throat> The donkey gets stuck, walks into a wall right here in the corner, and gets stuck. And then I get a null reference exception from the game. Because there's no pathing. So this person over here is leaving to get straw. And as soon as that blizzard starts, it's also happened a couple times with this one. Uh, it's, it's just like reading, this, history repeats itself. <laughs> don't, don't let my, uh, my wife hear you, I said that, but <laughs> that's just basically the situation. So this donkey, right, is getting a bunch of straw. And the blizzard is going to start sometime soon. It's going to take a while for that donkey to get back or whatever. I don't know what the hell happens. It's, it's, it, for some reason, it's outside of the village, right? And then I grab that person, trying to save his life, or that person's life. Um, and then what happens is that the donkey gets stuck. So that, the donkey can go right through the building for some reason. <laughs> Why? I don't know. It's just, it, just, it just can. It just can. And it's perfectly viable, apparently. That's that's fine. It can go through the, the, the wall, but it can't go through this gate. <laughs> if it tries, I get a non-reference exception. And the game crashes. And I have tried to record this episode three times, four times already. And this is the fifth. So I'm getting a little bit annoyed. But okay. Uh, nothing I can do about it. I'm just waiting for the blizzard to strike. I need to have uh, as much of this, um, these peas and everything else... Uh, planted, so that'll be fine. Oh, hello, little kids. I need to get the sticks. Or we only have six, uh, seven sticks. That's kind of nasty. And I, I need more sticks. The problem is, should I send a bunch of very delicate little guys, these guys, out here, knowing there's a potential blizzard coming any second? Ah, the moral dilemma. <laughs> uh <clears throat> Besides the moral dilemma, there's also another dilemma, right? Um, we have, of course, to get some points. We can go for sword making or we can go for horses. 
Donkeys are perfectly fine for right now. For the cards and everything else. Uh, so there is no real reason why I should get horses. <coughs> horses are perfectly fine. Um, instead of donkeys. And donkeys are perfectly fine instead of horses. It's, it's all balanced. <laughs> this is no problem right there. This person's getting a bit cold. So there is no real reason why I should go to horses. So I was thinking, let's go for sword making. Get the swords, everything else. But I don't need these technologies to be able to go to the Iron Age. I don't need them. I don't need any of these technologies. Oh, here comes the blizzard. So I have everybody outside. Well, not everybody, but a lot of people outside. And they're going to get cold. And there's a donkey somewhere outside here. I'm not quite sure where it is. Just freeze time and get everybody's picture. Alright, so I'm not going to touch any donkeys this time around. <laughs> Maybe that will solve the problem. New, bo new cattle born. Excellent. Come on, you guys. Run there. Run. <clears throat> Excellent. So I just need to be absolutely sure that I don't send any donkeys out. And where are you going? You are going to get longer. Why are you going to get longer? Even with winter, there's still too much work. I had a comment today. Somebody said that I was um, overloading my people with jobs. Too. <laughs> you are absolutely right. I am. This is so much to do, but I, I didn't. I didn't set the, the the repairs on most of these things. They do it themselves. I just. You, know, oh, you are not gonna make it. Run your ass back here. And get inside. <clears throat> Same goes for you, little kid. You may learn it to you too. All right. So I don't see any donkeys outside. So maybe, maybe this time everything will be all right. Maybe. <laughs> what are you guys, idiots? What are you doing out here? Going to get straw. I want, I want you to get some warmth. And where are you going? Going to get straw. Can, can you get inside instead? Can you also run? I need you to run. You don't have any... St you have stamina. Stop Stop lying. Everybody's coming inside cold. Where are you going? Going to drink. Um, that's not smart. <clears throat> can you Can you run for it then? No, I, I, I'm not gonna... I'm gonna make you run back. Come on, run back. Run your puny little ass back. <laughs> This kid over here, also same problem. This person over here, same problem. See, nobody can stay outside in the blizzard for very long. It's incredibly harsh. And I really, really hope that this time around <laughs> we don't get a crash. Alright, we get this person over here. I'm going to get straw. Health is really low. I need her to come back inside. I need to come back inside. Come on. I know it's a donkey. Donkey, stay. Stun donkey, stay. Stay, donkey. No. No, donkey. Oh, there goes a donkey. <coughs> Please don't give me a null reference exception. Please don't give me a null no reference exception. Please don't. Please don't. I ah, flip. Bloody hell. There it goes. Nearest node is very far from entity. Donkey. Entity position. Blah, blah, blah. Node position. Entity parent. Blah, blah. Ah, so this is attempt five. Next one will be attempt six. <laughs> Great. Okay, welcome back to another episode of Donna Man. Now, this is attempt seven, <laughs> and we are going through the same process again. Only this time, I'm going to speed it up so we get to the blizzard fast. So, speed 8. There we go. Bam, 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 bam. I'm just going to keep saving in the hopes that this will prevent our game from crashing again. And the problem is, even if I get through the season and through the blizzard alive, <clears throat> the problem with the donkeys doesn't go away. The next time I have a blizzard or the next time I let a donkey walk on its own, 
the, the, the problem could resurface. So there's nothing I can do about it right at the moment. And I don't know exactly how... Oh, there we go. Here's the blizzard. Let's go ahead and save it. Do you spell it with two M's? <laughs> I'll just... Fine, I'll do it like this. At seven. All right. Let's get rid of some of these jobs that people have to do. And I'm pretty sure that some people are going to die. But there's nothing I can do about it. <laughs> this game is a little bit messed up. <clears throat> Let's cancel all these. Beautiful. And... Ah, this, the stone has been added to the stone circle. Perfect. I had to cancel the stone circle thingy over here as well. So nobody comes over there. And I need to stop anybody from doing any mining over, over here. Alright, let's see if we survive this time. <laughs> We're close to high. Yes, I know. Now let's speed through this. I'm not going to touch anything. Because... Um, yeah, you know why. <laughs> uh, I want to get to the blizzard. And if we get to the blizzard, then hopefully the problem will be gone. New human born? Perfect. Anybody going to drop dead? Please say no. Got some new sheep. It is incredibly cold. Negative 13. All right. Blizzard is over. We have survived. <laughs> Alright, the way to get rid of that annoying problem was to just speed through it and to <laughs> not to help anybody. Apparently the, the donkeys can make it by themselves. Alright, let's just save that again. Bam, we actually went across the blizzard and we managed to get through that. Uh, yes, I want to overwrite. Please, 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 please. Alright, game has been saved. Take a sip. I don't care if the workload is too high. I have survived a massive nasty problem. <laughs> now the problem has been sent to the, to the devs. So I hope that they have uh, some time to uh, actually check it out. And perhaps just maybe be able to fix it for me. It would be nice. <clears throat> I like the game. And I like to be able to play it. Keep playing it. The way it's meant to be played. Without donkeys going to uh, the center of the earth. <laughs> if that's possible. All right, everybody's a little bit unhappy, but we still have everybody alive. Nobody died. It's excellent. Welfare is 55%. That's because of the, the winter conditions. Everybody has a little bit of damage. So, like, for instance, this kid here. Oh, no, no. This kid here. No. This, no. 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 <laughs> no. Oh, this guy, look at this guy over here. Has a little bit of damage. So, the majority of people have a little bit of damage. And that makes them a little bit unhappy. Nothing I can do about that. It's just a matter of, yeah, that's the, that's the case in this temperate climate. Um, can you run? <clears throat> Get that little kid up and nice and warm. So technically speaking, I don't actually have to help anybody, but I do like to. All right, there we go. We got that all set. Um, I need. Let's go back to the discussion. We need to go to the next age. We can go and get sword making so that we can get some better swords and better weapons so we can fight our tormentors, the raiders that come so now and then. Or we can go directly for iron smelting and then give us ironing. Iron and ironing. <laughs> iron and uh, hydropower and all these reinforcements. Not, not reinforcements because we don't have that technology yet, but uh, baking, for instance. That would be nice. And eventually steel. And that way we can finish everything. The thing is that we have... Uh, a bunch of milestones. We have to get the Megalovania, which means we have to get that last little uh, big ass rock and then get it over here. And um, we want to get all the tech. So, technocracy requires that we get all of the tech. Got some more sheep. Beautiful. Which means we do eventually have to get these two and, of course, horse domestication. The question is do we go? In this route, 
directly to iron smelting and then to hydropower and baking and then do the remaining techs, tech or should we go and do that tech first now i don't really care much for the uh, additional um, uh, towers come on click it there we go the reinforced fortifications i don't care about guard towers they don't do much much more than what we already have these towers are perfectly fine they do as much damage as the other towers the only thing about them we're low with knives how's that possible we have 11 knives only thing is that they do last a little bit longer all right let's see what do we have we got two bronze i want to get rid of all of the uh <coughs> copper tools that we have to make we got three bronze knives here we got two bronze knives okay um what do we need need some more animals of course we also need um, uh, picks and tools. The, the copper tools have been researched. They're all done. We don't need any more of those. We have to start looking into making uh, bronze tools. So that's what we're going to be focusing on. We need to have 10 bronze knives. And then we need to go for the next uh, step. This is, of course, bronze spears and bronze axes and preferably bronze sickles. <laughs> I like to have a lot of sickles. Uh, um, if you've been following my channel, you know why. All right, almost everything's been planted. Perfect. And that means we have, we will have plenty of food when the season comes. Uh, we do already have a lot of grain. Are they actually pounding the stuff? Are they making bread? Yes, they are. I just need to check to be absolutely sure that they actually are. Because we are running out of bread. We have a lot of flour and a lot of grain. Uh, running out of straw, though. But the winter's almost over. Winter is almost over. I think that the reason why we're running out of straw is because we're doing some uh, building and some uh, repair. So here, first, we have some straw. There's some straw over there. New humans joining settlement two. Okay, we got. Well, we're up to 58 population, but people are not happy. <laughs> it's just, uh, welfare is still dropping. Uh. <clears throat> why is everybody so unhappy? Is it because of the stones? Do you need more stones? <laughs> All right, let's get the stone. I need to get one more stone, and it is somewhere over here, behind the trees. This one. Get that one. I know I'm out of knives. I need more knives. Just leave me the alone. All right, we got a little problem. We haven't planted all of these seeds for some reason, and we're close to the end of winter. Are you guys trying to plant the seeds? What are you doing? You are going to chickpeas, you're going to chickpeas, and you are going to chickpeas. We are low on food. Yes, we are. It's a little bit in disconcerting. Um, I need to have more. I'm going to put these on high priority. I need them all done. Make the breads, peoples. All right, excellent. Make as much bread as you possibly can. Get this discrepancy uh, rubbed out. Beautiful. <clears throat> so do we have any more fires? Oh, yeah, here we are. Oh, we already have that one. Let's see. It's one, two, three... I'm pretty sure we had one more. Hmm. The problem is that these hearths need uh, fuel. They don't have any fuel at the moment. Surviving the winter plus one knowledge point. Perfect. We did not plant all of our chickpeas. That's a bit of an annoyance. So we won't be able to get that. But we're back in spring. Beautiful. That means we have to go hunting. We have to go get some meat. Now we do have a wolf family over here that I do not want to go hunt. Um, we have some boar over here that we could go and hunt. Or we have some goats. Hmm. Decisions, decisions, decisions. I'm looking around for other... Oh, we got some bears over there. I don't want bear. <laughs> I don't think bear tastes that great. Ooh, what's this? Oh, that's a log. Never mind. I thought it was a person. <laughs> Somebody just lying on the job. Um, so I think that we should set up a hunting party and go hunt some boar. We've got a nice little boar family over here. Now, I do know that some of our sheep and so on have to be slaughtered. I just don't see anybody doing that. Right, this here, the goat over here has to be slaughtered. And I'm pretty sure that we have some oh yeah, here, sheep over there. We have some more somewhere around here. It's going to give us some meat, but not very much. We need to get this bread up. And we need to get back to fishing. So, let's put down another fishing request in there. Let's get a whole bunch of people in that one. Let's see, one, two, three, four. 
And let's get another fishing thingy bajiggy over here. Uh, bam. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Oh, okay, three. Three is fine. Get some more fish, people. We're low on knives. Yes, we are. Um, I, I'm also low on, on people with brains. Come on, use them. Make some knives. We have the copper. I mean, the bronze. We have the bronze. We have all the bronze. Why don't we make them? Why don't we, why, uh, okay. I need people that can go hunting. Give me hunters. These are three very boring hunters. No, let's see. Can we get some more hunters? Um... <clears throat> I want to get this guy, these two people over here, and I want her to come as well. Come on down here. Make your way on down here. You are the three contestants in our new game. Will you go hunting? So come over here and come over here and get me a piggy. I can set this piggy for a hunt as well. And then they will eventually go and uh, hunt it down um, if it's necessary or if they have somebody available. We are low on food and we're work loads too high and we have no knives. <laughs> uh, we're making knives, we're making knives. Kind of wondering what the threshold is for low knives because we have 11 knives. So that means that 11 people in here somewhere have a knife. Now, if that was a the case in, say, for instance, um, Amsterdam Central Station, there were 11 people at the station with knives. That would be a serious concern for the people here for the police. But here, it's perfectly fine. Should we go for these guys instead? Hmm. You know what? Let's go for these guys. Come over here, kill that one. Imi died of old age. All right. As long as you didn't give me a, a null reference exception, I don't care. Where are you going? You're swimming over there. We are low on knives. I know. Let's as uh, yeah. I still want you dead, so I'm gonna leave you for the next hunt. And where are my people? There they are. So these are far easier creatures to kill because they only take like two, maybe maybe two, three arrows, two spears to actually kill. Bam. See what I mean? Next one. Get this one. And that one. So does any of you have a knife? Nope, you have an axe. There we go. Beautiful. Good job. So now you can go home. Now I need to get somebody over here to actually do the butchering. Does anybody know how to do butchering? Do you have a knife? You have a knife. Going to Watchtower. I don't want you to go to Watchtower. I want you to come over here and get that for me. Good. So, excellent. So she... Which lady? There's a lady over here. This one. This... Oh, it's not. It's a man. All right. That man is going to go and butcher that little goat for us. Perfect. That shouldn't be too bad. Right? And then we also have somebody over here. We'll, have, we'll need to get somebody over here to do the megalith cutting out. I wonder how long that's going to take. Anybody coming this way? No. Hmm. The problem is that they all find farming very important. Well, it is very important. I mean, I need it for my for my food. It's a major resource and a major source of my food. We got we got beer. <laughs> I got beer. Perfect. Oh, we got no straw. I would like to make another straw. I mean, a brewery. I'm gonna make another one of those. Let's go ahead and put down production. Let's put another brewer over here. And get as many people there brewing as possible. Perfect. Not close too high. I don't care. All right. Um, sheepy over here needs to be called. Oh, game must be saved. Another sip. Beautiful. Excellent, excellent, excellent. How is it going over here? Are you dead yet? No. <laughs> uh, is anybody over here yet? Uh, he's coming. How do I know it's a him? Well, because it says so. Not because he looks like a woman. Anyways. This guy is going to do all of our 
uh, harvesting over here, giving us a whole bunch of meat. And this little goat, baby goat, it's going to just watch. <laughs> little mouflon. Little baby mouflon. You just keep an eye on that, okay? Just watch how we take your mother and father apart. It won't be very long. I mean, it's, it's, it's kind of... I know it's very natural. Oh, we got another cow over here. Let's be culled as well. Nice old one. Hmm. We got one sword. Bronze. Got 12 knives now. Did the person that was making a sword, a knife, just leave? Huh. Alright, well, fine. Cool. I need, a, I need a bunch more knives. I need more people with knives so that we can do these harvesting a little bit faster. New donkey. Born. Perfect. How many animals do we now have? Domesticated animals. Uh, we got five goats, 16 sheep. Holy flip. Okay. Five piggies, seven cattle, and six donkeys. So my people don't have clothing. Are you guys just watching? This is a dead mouflon. <laughs> uh, I, I have actually seen a horse eat a rabbit. So I know they eat meat sometimes when they have the opportunity. So... I'm kind of wondering how this is going to go. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Can you come over here and harvest that meat as well? I mean, not harvest, but butcher that as well. <clears throat> Alright, let's see. We need to get some more animals. We need to get four more animals. And I'm kind of wondering which limits, what limits can we change? We've got six donkeys, donkeys seven cattle five piggies. If we go for more piggies, I think we can go up to ten. Hmm. The only real limit we have is on the goats. Everything else is just ten, 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 ten. So that shouldn't be a problem. Just guessing we don't have enough births. Can we get meat? Yes, going to get raw meat. Okay, we're all set in the kids. No school for you today, guys. Just go and get us a whole bunch of meat. Excellent. I, I like that. Now, with this person over here, we can actually just go and set him up to go and butcher everything. Oh, you're getting a little bit tired? Sorry, dude. I need you to do this. New donkey born. Excellent. Can you come and run this way? You don't, you don't, want, you don't want to run. Alright, just do whatever you want. We got lots of meat coming on the way. Good. We all of a sudden went to seven meat. Is that because that it also counts the meat that's like before? Yes, it does. <laughs> that's exactly how it works. Uh, it's a cow butchered, slaughtered. Should I close this gap here? I was thinking I should. Because the last time with the raiders, they just simply walked around this little gap here. And that wasn't really the purpose of a wall. So it kind of, kind of mitigates the purpose of a wall. Let's go and see if we can actually uh, build the palisades a little bit like, like that. <coughs> yeah, like, like that. Hello, goat. Can you move out of the way? <laughs> no? All right. Then you stay and I will go out of your way. Okay, okay like that. And then the last little bit goes to the wall over here. Should we do it like that? No, that's, that's not going to be right. Okay, let's just see. Can we... I need... I need that gap to close. I'm just going to do like that. Okay, fine. Like that. That's perfect. That will give us a nice little wall over there. Um, and then we'll do the same on this side. Should be fine. Got some more boat, goats. Perfect. Three more goats. Oh, hello to you too. Moo. Okay, we got some points from that. That gives us up to four, which is perfect. Um, we just need to get... All right, let's continue this. Let's see. Everything seems to be fine. We got some stone walls going up. Perfect. And we have... What, what's... What? Okay, we have a donkey over here. Where are you going? Adult donkey. <laughs> got a bunch of meat that we have to gather. I'm going to cancel... Oh, ships. They already... Somebody already killed that one. There's a significant group of wolves right there. And if memory serves me, there's another group of wolves 
Hmm. Somewhere around here. I don't know where they are though. Hmm. Okay, we'll wait. We'll wait for that. What happens and see what happens. Where it goes, what goes, what. In the meantime, how is everything? We are. Okay, we are. We're getting 40 meat already. Perfect. 40, 49 uh, vegetables. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Everything is going okay. We are building this. Uh, okay, we're not building that. It still takes a lot of uh, resources for that. Yeah. Do we? Okay, we do, we chop those wood, those trees down. I need to chop down more some more trees. I need to get some more people. So, um, cart. I need another couple of carts to come around. How is our metal process going? And this is going okay. This is going okay. Perfect. I need. All right, they're making bread, making flour. Perfect, perfect. Everything seems to be going okay. I can, I can, I can go and relax. <laughs> All right. The thing is, if we increase the size of our field here, say that we do. All right. We increase this, this, and we add an additional field here for barley, for instance, barley. Like this, this stuff. If we add that, I'm gonna do that. Um, Mm -hmm. Barley. Wait, should we put rye? What what, what exactly do we uh, we need wheat? <laughs> you human born? Perfect. Uh, plant mm, barley. That's a that's a quite a big field. I'm thinking this is probably the biggest field that we can make at the moment. Beautiful. Get that up. I wanted to plant this. Uh, field as well. We're not going to harvest it this this season because it's, only, it's not planting season at the moment. But it's fine. We'll get that in the next season. As soon as it's back. What do you got? You got nothing. Quick to totem. Right. Are we gonna get those meat people? Oh, here we go. Look at all these freaking wolves. Where they all come from? And some more wolves. <laughs> this is a that's quite a quite a number of wolves. And we got a young little young little boar here. Uh, I don't think that's gonna make it. Uh, Big old female boar. Run, baby boar, run! The baby pig needs to run. What, what are you doing? Why are you all the way out here? Going to boar. Alright, well, Vora, you do your thing. And we will do our thing over here. I, I really hope that she makes it out of there alive. The thing is, we got a whole bunch of kids over here. And we got wolves on this side and kids on this side. Defenses. Raw meat eating kids. <laughs> okay, well, fine. You eat what you want to eat, boy. Um, I'm just kind of wondering why that they would have programmed that in. Why would they allow kids, children, and stuff like to eat raw meat? I don't understand that. Are they vampires? These devs must be vampires. <laughs> Alright, let's get this all done. Um. We got somebody here with a, with a health prop? What's wrong with you? What happened to you? Crafting beer. We got another human born? Perfect. We have a limit of 67. So we definitely need to build an additional hut pretty soon. But I think... Oh, there goes a goat. Oh, there goes another goat. Bloody hell. We're just killing everything, aren't we? <laughs> There's meat everywhere. There's meat there, meat there. There's a the whole line of ants carrying meat. <laughs> Uh, where are the wolves? Where the wolves go? Are they coming back this way? There's a whole big pack over here, and uh, this, this poor little acquired bone. We've got another point. Perfect. Ah, uh, poor little doggy. Where are you going? Are you, are you missing your parents? Your little, your family is somewhere around here. I got another wolf, little wolf over here. That one captured the little baby boar. And now these guys are all moving towards the baby boar. Going to boar, going to boar. And here comes another wolf, going to boar. <laughs> They're all going to the same boar. How is this one little baby boar going to feed all of you guys? Holy shit, that's a lot of, a lot of mouths to feed. Alright, well, there's a lot of food here, so I'm pretty sure it'll be fine. Uh, just don't take my meat, okay? Just, just stay away from my meat. All right, everything's going fine, and I think if we keep on this trajectory, we should be fine. I mean, the next season will be harvest season, uh, autumn, and then we shall prepare for winter once more. Kind of wondering why these dead 
plants are still here. Okay, there we go. We are in autumn. Oh, sorry, fall. Which means we actually have to start harvesting. I want to harvest this stuff. Wait, come on. Not, not the spruce. And this one. Bam. That one there. So, acorn. Yes. And this one as well. Beautiful. Get me all of this. I need all of it. I need as much um, straw as possible. I need as much straw as possible. So I, can, I don't have to... I don't, I don't have a problem with the grain. It's just the straw. I want the straw. So I'm going to say, get that as well. Some of my people don't have any light clothing. I do not care. Where is the uh, boar lady? Um, oh, the boar is all gone here. There's no more boar there. All right, fine. We missed out on the boar. I think she ate all of it. <laughs> Going after sheep. You do that. Um... Now we have to harvest all this, which is good, because we can then we can finally use the straw. We need a straw for the brewery, we need a straw to repair some of these buildings, and we need a straw, of course, to feed all of our uh, animals, which we have uh, quite a large number of at the moment. Um, where are you going with all my meat? I'm going to get copper ore. We have five copper ore and 21 tin ore. I think we're doing quite well with... Are you actually hunting something? Oh, you're fishing. Okay. <laughs> uh, something like just standing in the water and not doing anything, actually. But okay, no worries. Okay, this sheepy over here needs to die. Are you, are you going to go for a chestnut? Okay, fine. Just just go go collect some nuts. And, okay, there. Finally, we're getting some wood. Finally. We have our six logs, but we need, we need way more. The thing is that we need to get as many... Oh, shit. The workload is too high. I need them to focus on the harvest, not on anything else. So I need them to I'm just gonna get rid of the fishing. Excellent. No more fishing. This is a fish free zone. <laughs> uh, and I think that the, the, the sticks will be fine. You can get that. Um, do we have anybody over here working on this? Yeah, we have the stone megaliths is now available, but I don't want to set it to the rolling yet until we actually have a little bit of this harvest in so we're gonna leave it like this for now all right now the game crashed an additional two more times after my seventh attempt uh from random donkeys running around so i've i, I have had to actually cut this episode up into uh, several little bits <laughs> and i'm gonna have to stitch them all together again Ah, wonderful. So the episode might be a little bit delayed tomorrow. My my uh, my apologies. There's nothing I can do. <laughs> ah, right. Well, this is good. This is good. We're getting everything we want. Straw is coming in. We got four straws at straw at the moment, and uh, I think that we have everybody. Yeah, everybody's working. We don't have an overload of work, and I think that uh, I think we'll be doing fine. We should have gotten these blackberries though. Bloody hell, we missed those. Not that we need them, because we have a lot of vegetables and fruits, some fishes, some raw meat, and a bunch of bread, and some... Yeah, okay, we're doing fine. We're doing excellent. I think that we're doing better than before. <laughs> so I don't think we have a problem. Only problem that we might have is, of course, this palisade. I don't want to build it in the middle of winter. It's not going to be any... Not, it's not going to be enough wood, that's for sure. I wish we could have a plantation like this, but then just for wood... So that they can automatically harvest those trees. That would be excellent. But I'm guessing that's not a, an option. <laughs> Alright, everything else is okay. Um, what I also don't like is that I can't actually ask anybody to pick these up with a cart. I wish I could send somebody with a cart over here and, and, and make them... Or force them to actually pick up all these logs. That'd be excellent. But sad enough. Yeah, not an option. All right. Um, let's finish off because I think that we have enough time now to make actually one episode out of four chunks, <laughs> three or four chunks. And uh, I will see you guys in the next one. Um, if you enjoyed this episode, leave a like. If you didn't leave a dislike, it's fine. I will see you guys in the next one where we. Uh, focus on getting this last little rock from over here to over here and get the stone circle done. That will give us our points and our milestone, which we desperately need. I want that milestone. We need to get that milestone 
and then we can focus on the next one which is technocracy well north settlement will be nice as well but it's 150 population we will eventually get that it's going to take a while this is natural oh we got 10 beer now perfect all right give me more <laughs> um we will of course uh try and focus on getting some more of these huts up and building uh once we have um enough people uh, then the game, the season is over, and then we can start focusing on the next one. We still have one more challenge to go, and then after that, it's hardcore mode. So that's gonna be fun too, right? It's gonna be a nightmare. I'm gonna die. Ah, <laughs> uh, you die? Yeah, dog just die on me. All right. Anyways, have a great evening. See you in the next one. Bye bye.